as we've discussed before, using good dialogue can be to show and not tell your reader what's going on. It can also be a good way, a gateway into your introduction. You can start with characters talking. When thinking about characters, remember what it means to have dialogue. Dialogue is what happens when two or more characters talk to one another. The exact words they speak are put between quotation marks. So if you're using dialogue, it could be fictional characters made up, or even if you're writing a personal narrative, true characters, true people, and what they actually said. And quotation marks are needed in order to actually do that. Writing really good dialogue is like writing a comic strip. So those comic artists, they only have a few boxes and they have to put as much dialogue as they can into those few boxes to make it fit or make it worthwhile. So if you look uh, at the boxes below, you'll see a, an example of a comic. Hey there. Hi, how are you? I'm good. That's good. Hmm. Hey, Donnie called me yesterday. Oh yeah, what's he up to? Oh, you know, same old thing. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. So if you only have six boxes of dialogue f for your comic strip, this would be pretty boring. I don't know if I would actually read this. It's pretty lame and snoozeworthy if you think about it. Readers want you to show them what's happening in dialogue, not just tell them. So as we move into our practicing, when you get in a class, to, it's your turn to make an interesting comic. You'll read the next directions. There'll be one for the first one, and that's where you'll, you'll make one, a dialogue that's between your main character and the villain in your story or another character in your story. On the next two, you can either continue the dialogue between those two characters or make up two different ones that you'd like to see. And here are your blank dialogue boxes down below. And this document will be shared with you in folders.